Super Saturday, uh, 3 p.m. game, the Warriors and Titans from Central Coast Stadium. This is a, actually a, a, a sneaky great this game. This will be close to one of the better games of the yeah. weekend, I think. Uh, the Warriors, RTS, Fusatua back, Aitken, Hiku, Mamalo, Cody Nikarima, Harris Tavita, Fanua Blake, Egan, Tanua Brown, Katoa, Sirinan, Harris, uh, Jazz Tavunga on the bench with Murdoch Masala, Armo and Bunty Tafoa. Warriors have the most hyphens in their team this year. Well done. Um, Brimson, Don, Kelly, Patrick Herbert does get the start in the centres. We speculated with Corey Thompson on the wing. So we no, I think a few of us. Yeah, Sammy's on the bench. Sammy benched. Uh, Ash Taylor, Fogarty, Wallace, Rain, Futawaka, Proctor, Fafida, Fasua Malami, Tyrone Peachy, Lasoni, Jalol, uh, Joel of <laughs> Aaron Clark, Philip Sammy not even in the 17. Neither is Herman, SASA or Sam McIntyre. Uh, Ollie, thoughts first of all on the lineup. Are you happy with I, that? I love Fasua Salami. <laughs> Fasua Malawi. He's nice sorry, sorry. A, nice on a subway salami. roll. Sorry. <laughs> Pure filth. <laughs> Fasua Malawi. Uh, the filthy. Yeah. Thoughts on the lineup. I mean, look, on paper, the Titans should win. But I mean, it's. I think it'll be game of the round. I think it'll be relatively high scoring and. Uh, to give my tip now, I think the Titans will win by four, but I am very worried as a Titans fan. Very worried about the Warriors. I feel like we'll be neck and neck in terms of place on the ladder this year. Uh, I feel like they're a team on the up, just like the Titans. They, they're they being mirrored in many ways, and I think we're in for an entertaining contest. I'm going to go with my boys. I'm, I'm going to say Rimo will get man of the match. First try scorer. Let's give it to Paddy Herbert against his old club. And you know, I thought Herbert was really good for the Warriors last year. No, one, no one's really talking about him. Yeah, great. But I he think can give up a try. He can absolutely give up six points, but he can he he'll scores. find some. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Keep going. Yeah, well, I just think he's a really underrated signing because people are talking about Tino and David Fafita, but mm. I think he's going to be a bigger a signing than people have made him out to be. Even Herman Essiesi as well. Mm. So, uh, Barney Boy, matchups. I mean, this is um, this is an exceptional game in my opinion. I think these teams, as Ollie said, match up pretty much straight. Down oh, the I was field. supposed to say things. And, um, and hang on, oh. Egan's fit, which we thought wouldn't happen. Sirian does start, which um, we weren't sure about. But uh, Bailey, who we all love, is starting, and yeah, Fus the combination of Fus to Aiken for the Warriors as well. Keep going. <laughs> yeah, no worries. Um, I had to do my job. It's <laughs> going to be a. A massive battle in the forwards. They've got both got some pretty big boys in that forward pack, and I, I think that's going to be an absolute bash up for the first half an hour. Um, you Harris and the Fuwa Salami running at each other. <laughs> that's um, going to stick now. <laughs> Filthy Fuwa Salami. Hot mouth. <laughs> Fafita and Sirin. Getting hungry uh, now. Katoa and Proctor. Like that back row battle is going to be a massive, a uh, massive uh, part to who wins this game. Uh, you got your fullbacks as well. You got AJ up against Roger. Like. The two of the better fullbacks running around. Um, I expect this game to be extremely close. It could go down to field goals, really realistically. Um, we've got Titans one to twelve. We've got Fogarty as my man of the match, and I'm going to go Brian Kelly first try scorer for the Titans. Gumpy, how are you looking at the match? Well, my first time on, but I c I couldn't pick the Warriors with my wife money any <laughs> week. So any week I'm enough. on, I won't tip them. Yeah, right. They. Can't convince me. They're just we inconsistent, yeah. and I don't know the hype on the Titans. I know they've signed some guys, yep. but their spine still, to me, is not a top six spine. Mm -hmm. yeah. Definitely, I've got big question marks on Ash Taylor yes. as a player. Their nine still, I'm not convinced. Mm -hmm. Fogarty is a is a first grader. But that's He's the first sort grader. of yeah. about it for me. But, look, I think that they've probably got enough. I, I think the coach can coach. <laughs> Definitely, like the way they finished the year yep. last year with the roster that they had to finish ninth, I think they overachieved 100%. I think they'll win. I don't – that doesn't fill me with any confidence. I'll, I'll go the Titans 1-12. to 12. I'll go the the first try score is um is Don is good on the wing. Don is good. He, I I love the old Donster. He's, yeah. he's, he's the default player. And look, I'm going to go the man of the match, uh, Big Tino. I think his first game. I think 
you know, sometimes Rip men in the matches a, a little bit, you know, they go a little bit sentimental. And if, if Tino gets involved and rolls his sleeves Media up, I think story, yeah. they might sort of go the, the story. But, um, you know, da- I think David Fafida is an untapped talent. Oh, yeah. Talking about the juniors Plenty like potential. I was before. I went yeah. a few years ago out to St Mary's to watch the Australian Carnival. And in the match was for Queensland, there was a, a kid playing David Fafida. And for the New South Wales team on one side of the field was Zach Lomax and Bronson Sherry. And David Fafita, every time they got the ball, they couldn't touch him. Just ran over. And, these were, and, uh, like, and this was... In, yeah. in, Made the Australian Voss is on record as saying he's the best schoolboy football he's ever oh, seen. Oh, look, he had spiders on him that day. And he, he's not any different now. Uh, he's just got to oh, get... when he's on, yeah. He's just got to get involved in the game. He's yeah. got to have the halves. And whoever's giving him the ball, just give him the ball and just say, run over blokes. Yeah. I think, you know, that'll be enough for the Titans, I think, to get home. And they probably, they'll probably end up making the eight because they've just... They've got... Some quality. They've got Tino. They've got Fafida. And what you have to remember is... They've got is Brimson. A, a, like I haven't mentioned, no one's mentioned Eight Brimson. teams really suck, so that's like they're, they're better than the other eight teams. <laughs> that's correct. Yeah. I think that they're a default probably yeah. sixth, seventh, But eighth, great ninth, point of Brimson because I, I just had a look while you were chatting. Um, only 5% of super coach coaches have AJ, and I think that's absolutely undervalued. I had him, and I... Got rid of him because I just love Pappy too much. The fullbacks are just yeah, there's, and then the there's obviously so I just love Super Pappy coach. too much, mm. and then you know, and I went for Latrell as my second fullback in I, I, I thought Latrell's still a good price, probably if for he, for yeah, well for no real reason, well for a reason. I, this year I decided I was in love with Latrell. I just said it, not Latrell, and then and I'm chips in Latrell, but I am now thinking maybe AJ might be a buy there for me in the last day. For me, though, um, very, very good uh, argument everyone's made, but I, I'm actually going to tip the Warriors 1 to 12. I, I, I only tip against hype because I think the punter in me wants to take on the market and go, these Warriors aren't, the Titans aren't as good as everyone thinks they are, and the Warriors aren't as bad as people think they are. And I think this will be a close game. Um, and I would not be shocked at all. I have no confidence in this, but I'm going to go Warriors 1 to 12. Uh, first try, Mamalo. And man of the match, which we haven't mentioned, for Noah Blake having a big again the fairy tales, big day out to go roll in and um, have a big impact here and um, be the one to take on this hot Titans Ford pack and actually step up and go come with me boys. Uh, I hope he is and I agree for everything he said. I think he does great analysis, Gumpy, uh, and we'll get into the main event on the Saturday in a sec after a pee. That's the game I won't watch because the races are on. Yeah, thanks. Actually, what are you doing, Sad? I'm much more fit. I've got the race away, got no kids. I'm going oh, no, to go. my miss is away too. Yeah, no, I'll watch you, huh? So, mate. Come up. And my, and, my, and my kids can stay at home on their own. 